brothers and sisters welcome back to our channel yawn with abarna in this video tutorial i am going to show you how can we crochet this easy and fast baby dress you can make this for all ages all sizes in this video i am going to make this for one year baby girl and also i tell the tips and tricks, uh, tricks for make this for all ages all sizes so the total length of the baby dress is 13 inches approximately 33 centimeter the width of the baby dress is 23 centimeter approximately 9 inches so let's start for this project i am going to use 3.5 mm crochet hook let's start uh, for this project i am going to choose uh, 3 play yarn now i am going to make the slip stitch sorry slip knot after making the slip knot now i am going to make some basic chain that is equal to the baby's neck circumference for this you take any one of the measurement dress you can see if you consider this is the measurement dress means this is the head circumference or neck circumference so i am going to make some basic chain that is equal to the neck circumference of the baby measurement dress okay so now i am going to insert the hook into this loop now i am going to make some basic chains one two three four five like this you are going to continue until you reach the next circumference of the baby dress it chain this is the head circumference of the baby sorry next circumference of the baby so this is enough for my project uh, if you make this for elder one means you are going to continue the same until you reach the next circumference so totally i did uh, 50 basic chains uh, you can see this is my first chain space i simply skip this first chain space i am going to work the second chain space you can see so you simply turn your chains you can see this is the back loop of every chain space now we are going to work only the back loop of every chain space uh, this is the ba first back loop i simply skip the first back loop move to the second one this is the second chains back loop into this i am going to make one half double crochet so yarn over once insert the hook only into this back loop so now I am going to make one half double crochet. So move to this next. You can see this is the next chain space back loop. Into this I am going to make one half double crochet. Only into this back loop I am going to make one half double crochet. So move to the next. This is the next chain space back loop. You can see into this I am going to make one half double crochet move to the next uh, this is the next uh, chain space back loop into this i am going to make a one half double crochet continue the same you simply make one one half double crochet in uh, every chain back loop until you finish this row you can see this is the back loop of this chain space into this i am going to make a one half double crochet this is the back loop of this chain space you can see this is the back loop into this i am going to make a one half double crochet continue the same you simply make one one half double crochet in every chain back loop i did one one half double crochet in every chain space after finish this row one make chain one and turn your project this chain one is only for the turning purpose so don't count this so i make chain one and turn my project this chain one is only for the turning purpose this is the first chain space uh, i am going to make a one one half double crochet in every back loop so this is the first chain space this is the front loop and this is the back loop i am going to work only into the back loop so yarn over once into the back loop i am going to make one half double crochet move to the next uh, into the back loop i am going to make one half double crochet move to the next into the back loop i am going to make one half double crochet so this is the front loop and this is the back loop i am going to insert only into the back loop of every chain space so only into the back loop i am going to make one one half double crochet 
into the back loop i am going to make one half double crochet into the back loop i am going to make one half double crochet continue the same you simply make one one half double crochet in every chains back loop you can see i make one one half double crochet in every chain space after finish this round to make chain one and turn my project this chain one is only for the turning purpose now i am work my round three so this is my first chain space into this chain space i am going to make one double crochet so yarn over once insert the hook and make one double crochet into the second chain space i am going to make two half uh, two double crochet into the same so into this chain space i am going to make two double crochet move to the next into this i am going to make one double crochet move to the next into this i am going to make two double crochet into the same so one two move to the next into this i am going to make one double crochet move to the next make two double crochet one then two you are going to continue the same make one double crochet two double crochet one double crochet two double crochet one double crochet two double crochet continue this you are going to continue for this row you can see i continue the same pattern for this round you can see one double crochet you can see one double crochet two double crochet one double crochet two double crochet one double crochet two double crochet like this i continue this pattern after finishing this uh, row three make chain one and turn your project so this chain one is only for the turning purpose this is my first chain space into this i am going to make one double crochet so into the first chain space i make one double crochet uh, skip the next one you can see this is the second chain space i skip this move to the second into this i am going to make two double crochet so one two two double crochet chain one into the same space i am going to make two more double crochet one and two okay so skip the next one into the second i am going to make one double crochet skip the next one into the second i am going to make two double crochet chain one two more double crochet into the same two double crochet chain one make two more double crochet into the same one two skip the next one into the second make one double crochet skip the next one into the second i am going to make two double crochet chain one two more double crochet into the same so two double crochet chain one two more double crochet into the same so you are going to continue like this uh, one double crochet skip the uh, next chain space into the second two double crochet chain one two more double crochet into the same skip one one double crochet skip one two double crochet chain one two more double crochet into this same continue the same pattern uh, skip the next one into the second make one double crochet skip the next one into the second i am going to make two double crochet one two two double crochet chain one make two more double crochet into the same one two skip the next one into the second make one double crochet skip the next one into the second two double crochet chain one two more double crochet continue the same pattern for this row after finish this round four make chain one and turn your project so this is my first chain space into this i am going to make one double crochet this is the chain one space uh, between two double crochet chain one two double crochet into this chain one space i am going to make two double crochet one two two double crochet chain one make two more double crochet into the same one and then two 
so this is the next double crochet into this i am going to make back post double crochet so like this i am going to make back post double crochet continue the same two double crochet chain one two double crochet into this space back post double crochet two double crochet chain one two more double crochet into this space back post double crochet continue this pattern for this row so this is the chain one space into this chain one space i am going to make two double crochet chain one make two more double crochet into the same okay this is the double crochet into this i am going to make back post double crochet continue the same this is the chain one space uh, so into this chain one space i am going to make two double crochet chain one make two more double crochet into the same so into this double crochet i am going to make back post double crochet continue the same this is the chain one space into this chain one space i am going to make a uh, two double crochet chain one two more double crochet into the same so one two two double crochet chain one make two more double crochet into the same this is the double crochet into this i am going to make back post double crochet continue this pattern for this uh, row two double crochet chain one two more double crochet into the same back post double crochet two double crochet uh, chain one two more double crochet into this chain one space back post double crochet continue this pattern for this row you can see i continue the same pattern so into this chain one space i am going to make two double crochet chain one make two more double crochet into the same Uh, this is the last double crochet ahead of this I am going to make one double crochet so after finishing this round make chain one and turn my project so it looks like this this is my first chain space into this I am going to make a one double crochet so into this chain one space I am going to make two double crochet chain one two more double crochet into the same one Two, two double crochet chain one make two more double crochet into the same so into this double crochet I am going to make front post double crochet if you are working in the right side of your project means you are going to make front post double crochet if you are working into your wrong side uh, of your project means you are going to make back post double crochet only for that reason in my previous row i did a, a back post double crochet in this row i am going to make front post double crochet so into this chain one space i am going to make two double crochet chain one make two more double crochet into the same one two so into this i am going to make front post double crochet so into this uh, chain one space i am going to make two double crochet chain one make two more double crochet into the same so into this i am going to make front post double crochet you are going to continue this pattern for this row make two double crochet chain one two more double crochet front post double crochet two double crochet chain one two more double crochet front post double crochet you are going to continue this repeat and repeat for this row i finish this row after finishing this row make chain one and turn my project uh, this is the first chain space into this i am going to make a one double crochet into this chain space i am going to make two double crochet chain one two double crochet into this make a back post double crochet two double crochet chain one two double crochet back post double crochet two double crochet chain one two two double crochet back post double crochet continue this pattern for this row after finishing this row i am going to continue the same the only difference is instead of uh, back post double crochet i am going to continue the uh, front post double crochet that is uh, two double crochet chain one two double crochet front post two double crochet chain one two double crochet front post two double crochet chain one two double crochet front post uh, 
so continue this pattern so after finishing these two rows i'll show you you can see i finish uh, two rows after finishing two rows now i am going to uh, move to the first double crochet chain space this is my first double crochet chain space into this chain space i am going to make the slip stitch make chain one this chain one is only for the uh, turning purpose i don't count this if you start every new row means make chain one only for that reason i am going to make chain one this is my first uh, chain space into this i am going to make one double crochet move to the next into this chain one space i am going to make three double crochet chain one three more double crochet into the same space in my previous uh, rounds i simply make two double crochet chain one two double crochet but in this round i am going to make three double crochet so into this i am going to make one two three three double crochet chain one make three more double crochet into the same one Two, three. Okay. So into this, I am going to make a front post double crochet. Move to the next. Into this chain space, I am going to make three double crochet. One, two, three. Three double crochet, chain one. Make three more double crochet into the same. One, two. So this is the next one. Into this, I am going to make front post double crochet. So you are going to continue this pattern: three double crochet, chain one, three more double crochet into this space, front post double crochet, three double crochet, chain one, three more double crochet into this front post double crochet. You are going to continue this pattern for this round. I continue the same pattern for this round: three double crochet, chain one, three double crochet, front post. On uh, three double crochet, chain one, three double crochet, front post. I continue the same pattern. Or uh, to finish this round, make a slip stitch into the first double crochet chain space. You can see this is the first double crochet. Ahead of this, I am going to make the slip stitch. Okay. To start the next round, make chain one. So in this stage, totally you have twenty four uh, clusters. I will explain. So this is a uh, uh, count as one cluster. Like this, you have twenty four cluster. So I am going to divide it for front, back, and also the sleeve. First three is used for the front. One, two, three. So this three is used for the front. Okay, one, two, three. The next, uh, uh, this uh, three is used for the back part. So one, two, three. The next six is used for the sleeve. One, two, three. Four, five, six. So this is used for the sleeve. The next six is used for the front. One, two, three, four, five, six. So the remaining, uh, the next six is used for the sleeve. One, two, three, four, five, six. The remaining three is used for the another back side. So like this, I am going to divide it. So three for the back, six for the sleeve, six for the front. Ah, uh, three, ah, uh, six for the sleeve. Uh, remaining three for the back part. Like this, I am going to divide it. If you have any doubt uh, in this uh, divide section, means please leave your comment in comment section. So let's start the next round. I already make chain one and turn my project. So this is the double crochet chain space. Into this, I am going to make back post double crochet. So yarn over once. Uh, insert the hook in backwards. Make one double crochet. So this is the cluster. This is the first three chain, uh, three double crochet chain space, and this is the next three double crochet. This is my first uh, double crochet. Into this, I am going to make one back post double crochet. So yarn over once uh, and make one back post double crochet. Into the next, I am going to make one half double crochet, back post half double crochet. Into the next, I am going to make one back post single crochet. So I am going to continue the same for the uh, next three. So one back post single crochet, one back post half double crochet, one back post double crochet. So one single crochet, 
one back post double crochet half double crochet one back post double crochet okay if you reach this cluster means you are going to make uh, uh, one back post double crochet back post half double back post single crochet going to reverse for the next three so back post single back post half double uh, back post double crochet so you are going to uh, work like this in the cluster if you reach this uh, double crochet chain space means into this uh, uh, this is the front post double crochet if you reach this means into this you simply make one back post double crochet in every front post double crochet you simply make one back post double crochet if you reach this cluster means you are going to make one back post double crochet back post half double crochet back post single crochet going to reverse for the next three so back post single crochet back post half double crochet back post double crochet so this is the front post double crochet into this i am going to make back post double crochet so now i am going to work in the cluster so work back post double crochet back post half double crochet back post single crochet so now i am going to reverse for the next three so back post single crochet back post half double crochet back post double crochet now i reach this marker uh, this is the first marking place for the sleeves this is the next marking place now i am going to fold like this this is the first marking place into this uh, chain space i am going to insert my hook you can see this is the next marking place into this chain space i am going to insert the hook so i am going to remove the marker into this chain space i am going to insert the hook now i am going to make one single crochet so turn your project so let's uh, continue like uh, one back post double crochet one back post half double one back post single crochet continue the same on back post single back post half double back post double so into this i am going to make back post double crochet continue the same for the front side after reaching this i'll show you after reaching this marker i'll show you it is very easy one you can see into this i am going to make a back post double crochet back post half double back post single uh, going to reverse for the next three so back post single back post half double back post double okay into this double crochet i am going to make back post double crochet you are going to continue this pattern until you reach the marking place you can see i continue the same pattern for this row uh, this is the marking place into this i am going to insert the hook this is the first marking place so move to the next one for the sleeve so this is the next marking place i am going to remove this ahead of this i am going to insert the hook now i am going to make the single crochet between these two so turn your project so remaining you have three clusters into this you are going to continue the same so back post double crochet back post half double crochet single crochet going to reverse for these three so single crochet back post half double crochet back post double crochet so ahead of this i am going to make back post double crochet so continue the same for remaining two after i finish this i will show you so to finish this round make a slip stitch into the first double crochet chain space so to start the next round make chain one now your project look like this 
so now we simply make one one single crochet in every chain space continue the same uh, make one one single crochet make a slip stitch into the first single crochet chain space make chain one uh, move to the next row make one one single crochet in every chain space make a slip stitch into the first single crochet chain space you are going to continue this single crochet row repeat and repeat until you reach the hip portion okay hip height uh, so i'll show you this is my first chain space into this i am going to make one single crochet so this is the next chain space into this i am going to make one single crochet in every chain space you simply make one one single crochet it looks like a round you can see it looks like a round so you simply make one one single crochet every chain space i simply make one one single crochet to finish this round make a slip stitch into the first single crochet chain space so to start the next round make chain one uh, this is my first chain space make one single crochet continue the same in every chain space i simply make one one single crochet to finish this round make a slip stitch into the first chain space you are going to continue this uh, single crochet row repeat and repeat until you reach the hip portion uh, after finishing uh, 10 or 15 rows i will show you you can see uh, i did uh, 10 row single crochet after that i reach the uh, uh, height of the hip so now i am going to start the next uh, part uh, that is the uh, bottom of this frog so i am going to start with chain 1 this chain 1 is only for the turning purpose this is my first chain space into this chain space i am going to make one double crochet this is my first double crochet into the second i am going to make one double crochet into the third i am going to make one double crochet so i make one one double crochet into the first three chain space this is my fourth chain space into that into this i am going to make two double crochet into the same so into this i am going to make one and then two so into the fourth chain space i did two double crochet so into the next three chain space i am going to make one one double crochet one two and then three so totally i work seven chain space uh, the first three chain space i make one one double crochet into the last three chain space i make one one double crochet into the center that is the fourth chain space into this only i am going to make two double crochet into the same okay after that i uh, skip the next two chain space so this is the next chain space this is the next chain space uh, i am going to skip the next two chain space into the third i am going to work so yarn over once uh, and i am going to insert my hook into the third chain space and pull the yarn okay this is count as one two and then three so in this stage totally i have uh, three six seven loops on my hook so yarn over the first six loops and then make one single crochet so this is called as one puff after make one puff i am going to make chain two into the same chain space i am going to make two more puffs so yarn over once insert the hook and pull the yarn one two and then three totally you have seven loops on your hook yarn over the first six loops make one single crochet then make chain two so this is called my second puff i am going to make one more puff into the same chain space so yarn over once insert the hook and pull the yarn one two and then three totally you have seven loops on your hook yarn over first six loops make chain one okay so totally i did three puff in this chain space so after making three puff into the same chain space skip the next two chain space one two i skip the next two chain space into the third i am going to make one double crochet into the next to make one double crochet into the next to make one double crochet 
after making three double crochet in a uh, three chain space into the fourth one i am going to make two double crochet into the same one into the same chain space i am going to make one one more so after making a two double crochet into the same i am going to make one one double crochet into the next three one two and then three okay the repeat pattern of this row is make three double crochet chain two three double crochet uh, sorry three double crochet chain two three double crochet skip two chain space into the third make three puff uh, so uh, between every puff you are going to make two chains after that skip to three double crochet three one one double crochet then uh, into the fourth make uh, increase make three double crochet into the next three chain space after that you are going to skip uh, next two chain space so one two uh, after that i am going to skip next two chain space into the third i am going to make the puff so one two three totally you have seven loops on your hook on our first uh, six loops make one single crochet then chain two this is one puff you are going to make a uh, totally three puffs so one two three yarn over first six loops then one single crochet chain two one two then three so yarn over first six loops then one single crochet so after making three puff into the same chain space skip the next two chains one two into the third onwards you are going to make a one one double crochet in the three chain space one two three into the fourth you are going to make a two double crochet so one and then two so after that you are going to make one one double crochet into the next three chain space one Two, three. After working these uh, seven chain space, skip the next two. One, two. Into the third, you are going to make the puff. So one, two, then three. Totally, you have seven loops on your hook. On the first six loops, make one single crochet, then chain two. One. Two, three. Yarn over first six loops. One single crochet, chain two. Make one more. One, two, three. Yarn over first six loops. Make one single crochet. So after that, uh, skip two. Working on the next seven uh, chain space. Uh, skip two into the third. Make a puff stitch. You are going to continue this pattern for this round. Continue the same pattern uh, for this row. To finish this row, make a slip stitch into the first double crochet chain space. So I am going to make a slip stitch. To start the next round, make chain one. This is only for the turning purpose. If you start every new row, make chain one. Uh, so now I am going to make one one double crochet. You can see. I skip the first. Uh, oh, sorry. So into the first one, I am going to make one double crochet. So I am going to make one one double crochet in every chain space. If you reach this uh, uh, two double crochet into the same chain space, means in this uh, chain one space, you are going to make one double crochet, chain one, one more double crochet into the same space. So I am going to make a uh, one. Two, then three. So after making this, you are going to reach this chain one space. If you reach this chain one space, means into this you are going to make one double crochet, chain one, make one more double crochet into the same. This is the two double crochet in your previous row. So into this you are going to make one double crochet, chain one, one more double crochet. After that, I am going to make one one double crochet in every chain space. 
so uh, i skip this uh, one double crochet chain space uh, if you reach the puff means before that and also the after that puff you are going to skip one double crochet chain space only for that reason i skip this uh, double crochet because it is uh, before this uh, puff stitch so i am going to skip this so for this i am going to make chain 4 i am going to make a single crochet ahead of this center puff this is the center puff ahead of this i am going to make one single crochet after that make chain 4 so for this chain 4 i am going to skip one double crochet after this puff stitch i am going to skip one double crochet from the second i am going to make one one double crochet one two then three. after making three double crochet you are going to reach this place this is the two double crochet in your previous row so into this i am going to make one double crochet chain one make one more double crochet into the same okay after that you simply make one one double crochet one two so this is the double crochet before this puff stitch so i am going to skip the one double crochet before this puff stitch uh, instead of this i am going to make chain four make a single crochet ahead of the center puff chain space so i am going to make the single crochet after that i am going to make chain four skip the uh, one double crochet chain space after this puff move to the second from the second i am going to make one one double crochet one two three so after making three double crochet you are going to reach this place this is the two double crochet in your previous row into this i am going to make one double crochet chain one make one more double crochet into the same okay after that you are going to make two double crochets in the next two chain space i skip this because this is the double crochet before this puff stitch i am going to skip this instead of this i am going to make chain 4 1 2 3 4 so from the center puff chain space i am going to make a single crochet so this is the repeat pattern you are going to make a, a, a one one double crochet in every chain space uh, if you reach this uh, two double crochet means you are going to make one double crochet chain one one more double crochet after that you are going to make a uh, two double crochet in the next two chain space if you reach the puff means before that and also the after that you are skip one one double crochet chain space instead of this you are going to make chain four make a single crochet ahead of this uh, center puff chain space make a four chain space so you are going to continue this pattern repeat and repeat for this uh, round it is very easy uh, three uh, double crochet into the center make uh, one double crochet chain one one double crochet then two double crochet after making this uh, you are going to make chain four one single crochet chain four continue the same you are going to continue this until you finish this row you can see i continue the same pattern for this round uh, so to finish this round make a slip stitch into the first double crochet chain space so round 2 is completed we are going to continue this uh, two rows repeat and repeat until we reach the desired length of the dress so i will show you once again and i am going to explain it once again so this is the first chain space so i am going to make chain one to start the new row so this is my first one so into this i am going to make one double crochet so we don't consider this double crochet this is only for the starting purpose uh, normally we are going to skip the uh, in puff uh, uh, in the second row we are skip the first uh, uh, double crochet before this puff and also the after the puff uh, if you consider this is the puff means after this puff uh, usually we are going to skip this uh, but this is the initial this is the first double crochet in every row only for that reason we simply make one one double crochet in every row but in the pattern wise we skip the uh, uh, double crochet after the puff stitch this is the 
pattern but we are going to start every new row in this place only for that reason we simply make one double crochet we don't uh, uh, apply the pattern in this uh, chain space only okay so now uh, we are going to continue these two patterns repeat and repeat now i am going to start my row one this is my first row so i am going to make one one double crochet in every chain space so like this uh, i simply make one one double crochet if you reach this chain one space means uh, this is the chain one space if you reach this chain one space means you simply make a uh, one double crochet chain one one more double crochet into the same so this is the chain one space so i am going to make one double crochet chain one one more double crochet into this space make one one double crochet in every chain space so i work this row one so after finishing this set we are going to move this uh, single crochet chain space into this single crochet chain space we are going to make these three puff stitch so yarn over once insert the hook into this chain space make the puff one two then three yarn over first six loops make one single crochet chain two this is one puff stitch we are going to make two more puff into the same one two three yarn over first six loops make single crochet chain two one two three yarn over first six loops make a single crochet so this is the puff after that you are going to continue make one one double crochet in uh, every chain space one two three four so this is the chain one space uh, into this chain one space i am going to make one double crochet chain one make one more double crochet into the same if you make this means uh, uh, the one uh, stitch is increased compared to your previous row okay like this in my previous row i have one two three four five six seven so seven uh, seven double crochet in my previous row in this row 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 uh, it is increased to 1 so in every first row uh, this is two row repeat pattern in every first row the number of uh, double crochet is increased one by one uh, if you ask any question uh, in this stage also we skip one double crochet uh, because in the second uh, row we skip one double crochet from the starting and also the ending also uh, you have the question so this is going to be decreased no more because in the center we are going to increase the one double crochet chain one one more double crochet only for that reason the total number of the double crochet is not increased and also the not decreased okay is the only reason so you are going to continue this two row after finishing this row uh, 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 you are going to continue the same uh, so yeah, ahead of this single crochet make puff so into this you are going to make one one double crochet uh, if you reach this chain one space means make one double crochet chain one one double crochet you are going to continue like this after finishing this uh, round one make uh, after finishing this round one you are going to continue this round two round two is very simple pattern uh, so uh, make one one double crochet in every chain space into this you are going to make one double crochet chain one one double crochet after that you are going to make one one double crochet but you skip the one double crochet chain space before this puff and also the after this puff instead of this you are going to make chain four make a, a single crochet uh, ahead of this center puff so after that make chain four skip the first double crochet make one one double crochet skip the last double crochet so into the center you simply make one double crochet chain one one double crochet so, so please remind this after this make a chain four make a single crochet ahead of this center puff make a chain four skip one double crochet please remind this before this puff skip one after this puff skip one you are going to continue these two row repeat and repeat until you reach the design length after reaching that i'll show you 
can see I continue the two rounds repeat and repeat until I reach the length of the baby dress now I am going to work the back part of this push uh, of this dress so now I am going to work in this place so in this place I am going to make two row of single crochet so join the yarn make chain one this chain one is count as one single crochet okay move to the next space this is the next space into this i am going to make one single crochet move to the next space into this i am going to make one single crochet continue the same in every chain space you are going to make uh, one one single crochet if you reach this double crochet space this or uh, double crochet space uh, if you reach that means uh, make two single crochet into the same space you are going to continue like this way after reaching this i will show you I did one row of single crochet after finishing this make a chain one and turn my project this is the first uh, chain space into this chain space I am going to make one single crochet so after that I am going to make chain three one two three if you make uh, if you uh, if uh, uh, if you attach big size button mean this chain three is enough okay but I am going to attach small size button for that reason I simply make chain 1 so after that move to the same space this is the same single crochet chain space into this I am going to make the slip stitch so it's going to be like that okay after that you make one one single crochet in every chain space so you are going to make one one single crochet in every chain space after reaching this uh, you are going to cut the yarn after finish this I will show you you can see I finished two row of single crochet now our dress is ready I attach one small floor into the front side I already make a tutorial uh, in our channel so I give the link in the description box for make this floor going to check this uh, so finally our dress is ready it's turned out so well uh, it is very easy to make so all or try this project if you have any doubt means please leave the comment in comment section so try this and share your valuable thoughts with me thank you friends have a nice day